strep throat. It is often treated and cured with antibiotics. But what happens if it just keeps on coming back and back and back? A local Files Hero Joyce has more in today's Health Watch. Even if you get it just once a year, strep throat is a pestering problem. But imagine getting it once every other month. It was the reality for one local child. Here's her story. Addison Isles was out of school, and her mother Leslie was out of options. She started kindergarten last year. She would miss two to three days every time she had strep. It was a reoccurring theme. Every two months for about a year, little Addison would develop a sore throat accompanied by stomach pains and noticeable tiredness. We got to the point where enough was enough and we needed to come to Dr. Malin to find out what we could do. Dr. Mayland, an ear, nose, and throat surgeon at Aurora Bay Care Clinic, deals with cases like this often. She says Addison's situation is a common cause for tonsil removal, but it's not the only one. It's not just strep. That's a common misconception for taking tonsils out. If, if When we say sore throat, it could be due to a virus. It could be due to another bacteria. About a year ago, a multidisciplinary panel issued strict guidelines to use for the procedure. After discussions with Addison's mother, Dr. Malin decided surgery was the best option. It takes about half